We're going to Phuket. We're going to Phuket. <laughs> I'm excited to get back on the road again. We've been spent a week in the Gombe at the end of Sri Lanka trip, so we didn't get COVID. We've had to stay in Bangkok for five days because of PCR tests on day one and day five. So and Bangkok's great. It's all shows you Koh Road and everything, but it's just it's been decimated by the yeah. I don't know if say COVID or. I'm going to say it anyway. The pandemic. The pandemic. No, Thai Viet... No, Thai Vietjet Airways is where we're flying with. Never heard of them before. So I'm going to put a cigarette and then run in and... Uh, we're oh. well early, but at least we're at the airport. Which is fun. I need food. Fun, fun, fun. She's getting hungry now. We thought that the cab was taxi would take us the wrong way at first, but I think you had to go up, up the motorway and then come back down again, and it cost exactly what they said it would, so... Yeah, it was a bit worrying at first. I was like, where the hell are you taking us? Looks like you're taking us well out of our way, but it's all good. So yeah, let's get in, get through, and then uh, go from there. Neon lights up there. We just paid 600 Thai baht for a taxi. Which, took an hour. Yeah, it's not bad that it took an hour, but we were going to take a bus because it'd be 100 baht each. Yeah. But we'd missed the earlier bus and the second bus left at 10 o'clock and we got there at 7. So we weren't going to wait three hours. <laughs> For a bus, especially there's no restaurants, no anything. If there was, we probably would have tried to behave. But, uh... Now we are going to try and behave, though. We spent a lot of money today. Yes. But yeah, this is the room. It's pretty clean, pretty nice. It's big, it's much bigger than the last one. It's not as posh, but... Mmm, time for a cigarette. Time for food. Oh, it's right? Right, and then follow the road. Okay. We are in Phuket. Slept rubbish last night. I mean, we have aircon, but for some reason it just doesn't cool down the whole room, so... so we were here last night. We got here quite late. We needed food. We walked out of our hotel and this whole place... It's a food market. Obviously, it must only be open in the evenings, but works out great for us. We're just heading out now for breakfast and see what well, the beach and sounds like really. Stuck in the 
opportunity for a week. Might as well do Love Bank after we've been, been ready for this ages. Bangkok's amazing, it's obviously it's just a city in it, so it's nice to get to the beach. Especially when you haven't been on in the sea for so long. Clear and it is sea. hot. It must be like 34 degrees. It was last time we checked. But this is the calmest sea that Yeah, we've I seen. can go in it without being taken out by the currents like in Sri Lanka. Yeah. Sri Lankan beaches are lovely obviously, but yeah, they're a bit more aggressive, the current and the waves. Which is fine if you can swim, or at least swim confidently, which Kelly isn't either. <laughs> <laughs> Kelly can just about swim, so it's terrifying when for I her, relax, which is understandable. When I it's fine. I could fly around in the water all day, but um, we struggled to find breakfast this morning. We literally walked around for like 45 minutes. Everywhere was closed or opening late, because I guess around here is quite a party town. Yeah, the bit we're at is definitely party orientated. There are probably 60 bars that aren't like... Yeah, what I mean, yeah. There are just bars, pubs everywhere. We couldn't find a 7-Eleven or one of those mini mart places. They're all shut. But yeah, it's beautiful here. So very excited to see the rest of Thailand. Next up is going to be Koh Phi Phi which I think we're going to go tomorrow. Yeah, we've already been in this country a week. Yeah. And uh, we've only really seen Bangkok and this part of Phuket. There's probably lots to see in Phuket that we haven't done, but I really want to get to like PP and show Kelly PP. PP. Definitely going to start raining soon. So after the beach, we come back here and chilled out on a pool. There's another couple of couples here, but they've walked off. It's nice to get the camera out now. But look at this. And we booked a pee pee. Yeah, we're going to pee pee tomorrow morning at 7.30, which means you've got to get up at like half six or something to quickly go to 7-Eleven and grab something to eat. Look at those views. feels and looks like it's going to absolutely piss it down. It should be nice. But yeah, PB tomorrow. PB! Uh, I have got stir fried chicken with basil and rice. I've got Tom Yum Goon with shrimp. We are hungry. We got it from that place there. I know this is the fucking craziness. How is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, good. You like it? Yeah, I'm nice. She likes it. What are you going for? Strawberry and apple smoothie. Last night we got here at like 8, 9 o'clock and it was even. People have definitely come to life. It's the only 7 Eleven that we can see that's open. Yeah. So this is. Lots of 
fruit. Let's get a kebab. Wow. Badass. A lot of fruit, isn't it? I don't remember there being so much fruit last time. Yeah, this is what I'm going to get now. Proper chicken kebab. I had one yesterday and it was fantastic. I'm looking forward to this. 100 bar. Could get cheese there, actually. I said just that. Could get cheese, isn't it? Could have cheese. Oh, wait. Rupert is about to just somehow devour this chicken kebab. Yeah. Been looking forward to it. See how much he loses. <laughs> Good. Mm -hmm. That was a pretty impressive bite. <laughs> also very happy about my smoothie. In Sri Lanka they didn't do any berries or apple or anything in the smoothie so it's nice to bring something that tastes different and I love berries in a smoothie. Find the bun. Being, yeah, really puts me off. Yeah, I know you mean. It's about just leaving your life. Yeah. But I guess I definitely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Many clothes. Probably she has most things are too short. Especially the guy with that ass. Uh -huh. I'm alright, thank you. I'm good, thank you. Many clothes. I'm not going to put this down there. They are cool. Good morning. It is currently, hold on, focus. Focus. Oh. Well, look, it's 6.42 in the morning. We're getting up. We're getting up. Let's get ready to go. Peace with <laughs> And it is raining. I reckon it'll clear up pretty soon. 